Does anyone ever know that like our DOE labs, like Los Alamos, were studying all this plasma stuff? Like we knew they were studying plasma, but we didn't know what they were doing. We just thought, oh, they're studying plasma. It turns out they're literally studying EVOs. They're studying field reverse configurations. They're studying to make some plasma orbs that are freely floating and stable. They're studying all of it. Helium-3 deuterium fuel. So that's a neutronic fuel. Thrust is obtained by a magnetic nozzle where plasma flowing along the open field lines is mixed with propellant. Miley? Wait, is that George Miley? George Miley is one of the world's leading experts on inertial confinement fusion, by the way. A possible route to small flexible fusion units. G. H. Miley, 1979. Conceptual design studies of a small deuterium helium-3 field reversed mirror fusion plant are described. If achievable, the basic unit termed Sapphire would produce a few megawatts of power. By stacking of units, however, plants could be built in the tens of megawatts of size. How do we keep finding shit like this? literally talking about doing a neutronic fusion reactors using helium-3 deuterium this is the reference from what paul says his book right there here it is a possible route to small flexible fusion reactor george miley 